So the brand new game, Metroid Prime 4, has been released, so naturally it's time to test whether or not it works in the two most popular Switch emulators. This game is a whopping 27 gigabytes, so it takes up a ton of space and it takes a while to uh, get. But after setting it up on Eden, when I tried to start the game, it loads, goes black, and then crashes. Doesn't seem to work, sadly. Next up, I tried on Ryu Jinx, and I even installed the firmware built into the game, along with installing the latest keys before giving it a go. And when I started the game, it began loading, went black, and then crashed. And here you can see in the console that there is an issue, and some important information I did find from an emulation enthusiast. Gaming Gamer says, as of right now, the game does not launch in any emulator with any configuration. Something related to the audio is borked. That's really unfortunate. But they do give us some hope here. I was able to get it running and to the menu with a custom build of Ryu Jinx using OpenGL. But it still crashes shortly after the menu screen and audio is crackling. So unfortunately, the compatibility is not what we want to see. But I'm sure we'll see some updates in the future that allow this game to work. Make sure to check the pinned comment if there's any updates, I will put them there. Subscribe and hopefully stay tuned for when this game works in your emulators.